there is a book Divaswapan written by Giju Bhai Badeka in 1928 what one teacher could do in a school motivated teacher very earnest teacher honest teacher could do in a school so one example is he went to the school the children were very 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 naughty you know fighting each other throwing stones abusing each other and so he is very pained so next day he says holiday for you so children are running away from the school this is the book written in 28 while the children are running away he folds hands he says that i have given you a chutti i want to tell you one story which i had read as a child so the children said he is a good man okay let's hear the story so the story starts there was a king who had who had seven palaces two lines and there is silence in the class the story goes on for 3 hours the bell rings children say sir please don't end the story <laughs> next 10 days only stories in the class and the children are sitting in a circle any child who makes some noise the other one <laughs> shut, shut up shut up go out, go out. <laughs> 11th day when Giju Bhai comes, children say more stories. He says that all the stories I had learnt, I have recounted to you, I don't know more. But you see, how many children are in a class? 50 children. Uh-huh. And all of you have the same three textbooks, uh-huh. class 4. One Gujarati, some civics, some. Uh-huh. It's idiotic, every child has the same stupid textbook, don't do that. So every child, you give me money for three books. Ah. And you've liked the story so much for every child I'll buy three different story books. So he's in 1928 in Bhavnagar, he brooms out all the textbooks and starts with a library of 150 books. So the dream was dream was not three books, my children must read 150 books. This is that story written in 1928 by Giju Bhai. He was inspired by Montessori. He's a amazing man.